What up, it's Melvin7 here. It's a fucking miracle. I'm finally on the shitty EA servers. The little gerbil Keith has finally got his legs moving. And we're on after five hours. Jesus fucking Christ. Anyhow, so we already know what's on. Um, uh, well, I don't know every single SPC, but this Inaki Williams, uh, we'll have a look and see what it requires. So it needs an 84 and an 85 to complete. I might do this to be honest, it looks like a nice card and obviously you can choose what you want uh, in terms of stats which is really really good so is there a way to reward details, here we go. So you either can choose uh, him to have extended dribbling or shooting. So for me on this game I I'm not actually sure, like I'll be honest, uh, logic would say shooting but dribbling is really really uh, important this FIFA so you know, it's a good choice and it opens the doors to so many different possibilities. Um, wow, there literally is no other SBC. There's not even a puzzle SBC, really? It's the start of Rule Breakers, man. I know you've already broke your servers, but uh, I was expecting there to be a puzzle SBC. We already know, obviously, it is McCule, or however you say it, the right back for Leipzig. And this one is in Friendlies, which is great. Uh, they've put a Rule Breakers Classic mode in there for people to complete this. It's not on Rivals. It's still skill-based matchmaking, though. So, um, yeah, Pfft, there's a few uh, decent packs there. Win six matches, score 12 using Bundesliga players, uh, score six using uh, score in six matches using French players. Uh, assist five goals using French defenders and assist four goals with crosses with Bundesliga players. So, yeah, the Bundesliga French players are about to uh, you know, explode in value pretty much. We've got week three bronze and nothing else. I'm a bit surprised with that. Uh, anyhow, we can claim our rewards for losing with uh, Erlen Haaland, which is just annoying because I thought he would win. But, oh, there's a new one. Wait, is it? Oh, there's a new event. Oh, shit. European powerhouses. Stake your claim in the Battle of the European Powerhouse. Compete uh, compete at at least one team event. Objective to be eligible for event role. You can either get a lone Schweinsteiger, a lone Raul, Del Piero, Makaleli, or Rijkaard. Oh. Wait there. Is... Ah, I don't know who to pick here. I think I'm going to go with Bastian Feinsteiger, to be honest. German genius, are you sure you want to select this team? Once a team is confirmed, the selection cannot be changed, and you will represent the team for the whole duration of the event. Yes! Right, here we go. So there's five different teams now. Uh, what do we get as rewards? Now that I've picked... Wait, what? Do you... Wait. What? Is the, the reward a Feinsteiger? Do you not get that for choosing that team? What? This is weird, man. Like, what? I love the premise of this, but that can't be the reward. That's got to be glitched. Like, you get a T4 and a... What? Oh, right. Let's see what the objectives are for it. Uh, German genius. So you get a premium electrum players pack for this. Uh, I will have a video for the quickest way to do this, because I imagine you need T4s and that sort of thing. Oh, no, you don't. Wow. Okay, so assist using a German midfielder in 10 separate matches. Win five matches with at least one German player that plays in the Bundesliga in your starting squad. Score 10 goals in squad battles using uh, Bundesliga players. And play two squad battles matches on minimum semi-pro difficulty with at least four German players in your squad. Perfect. That's going to really um, help. Uh, sorry, that's going to be good because I can kind of build a team that works for the Mikul as well as that German genius. So I like that. I'll have a video on that ASAP. Would have been out probably by now if the servers had worked. Anyhow, uh, where's my 5k pack? There we go. It's there. Okay, so we've got promo packs in store. Prime gold players pack. Obviously, I'm not going to actually open them. But yeah, we got six packs in store from Marky Matchup, so I'm going to open these and then I'm going to get to work on uh, some of the content, really, and try and get some videos out for you. Uh, currently on Champs at the minute, I'm 8 for 5 in terms of wins and losses. So, yeah, it'd be nice if we could get a rule breaker after not being able to access the servers for so long. But again, I love the idea of team events, but surely the, the reward can't be a lone icon. Like... 
you should be getting the lone icon to play with to get the objective to get a pack like i i don't understand and i also don't understand the ranking system because there's five different teams so how if, if you finish fifth like are you still going to get your lone icon makalele if that's what you picked like i, I don't understand how it works but anyhow oh oh that's a ucl board in it uh that doesn't really matter what we're looking at uh Kolarov, not too bad the, the ucl cards don't really go for anything though at the minute i don't think we'll have a quick look but i doubt it um yeah they're about 2k um but yeah i, I really want to try and invest in the rule breakers cards but because the servers have just screwed up i don't actually know when the best time to buy them is now uh so that's probably went out the window but we're, we're gonna have a look uh see if people can get on open their packs and i want to invest two million i literally want to invest two million in certain things so i can try and trade get a lot of uh profit in and hopefully get some mad icons and that kind of thing wow a 75 rated gold was our highest in a 15k pack you love to see it right i'm gonna open the 25 first then the prime electrum and we're gonna call it uh, a day pretty much for this video so in terms of, of being Being able to choose a stat upgrade uh, that that's huge like that opens the door to so many possibilities the McKeeley or however you say it, the right back uh, objective is a big big win massive win he's really overpowered he links to a lot of overpowered cards on this game uh, and as for the team event I like the idea I think the concept is a win but so far the rewards are huge L's especially if it's just a lone icon that you get it's kind of pointless to be honest but i'm still going to complete it for the premium electrum um pack i'll have a video on that hopefully we can pack uh, some rule breakers but yeah peace